Hello everybody, welcome back. So, I, I got a new bookshelf. It's a very pretty bookshelf. I love it so much. You can't see the whole thing because I'm sitting down, but it's it's really tall. When I got this bookshelf, I actually had to build it myself and I cannot build anything for the life of me. I just, I can't. I'm really bad. The instructions were really bad too. So I had to build this and it was really painful and long and I hated it. But it's finally built now. I just smacked my arm on the wall. It's finally built now. This video is gonna be dedicated to me building this bookshelf. You get to watch me in pain building this. It was a terrible, terrible time and I hated basically every second of it. I mean, I guess that's it. So without further ado, here we go. Here's me building this bookshelf. That's not supposed to go there. I just jacked up everything. Look. I'm so sad. And I can't get it out now. Screw these instructions.
Guess who built their bookshelf upside down? Guess who wants to die? No. Ugh, I'm so mad. These are literally the worst instructions in the whole world. I'm not joking. Oh, what? See how at the very bottom, there's a little gap? Because it needs to stand up. There's a gap on the top now. Cause see, there's a gap. That's supposed to be the bottom. But this stands. little guy, I can't get it out. What do you mean you can't get it out? I can't get that tiny piece of wood. I, can, I can't get that out. It's hammered in and like from the inside. And so you like rip it out, which I don't even know how. Hopefully it wasn't too boring. I thought it was kind of interesting, but I just really like time lapses So maybe that's just me. I guess I'm gonna show it to you now I guess the bookshelf I put all my books on it already obviously so I guess I'll show it to you So on my first shelf I have all of my Cassandra Clare books including Lady Midnight the Shadowhunter Codex and then I have Twilight and I have the picture of me, my friend, and Dan and Phil from when they went on tour. Next shelf is basically contemporaries or anything that reminded me of contemporary and that's just because they all look really nice together. And then as you slowly go down, you kind of just see, I put as many contemporaries as I could on here and then my Hamilton books and then it slowly gets less contemporary and more dystopian or whatever, all my John Green books, and then definitely, definitely not contemporary books at the very, very bottom. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked it, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you wanna see more. If you wanna leave a comment down below about anything, feel free. And I will see you soon with another video. Bye.